Was that a gunshot? Okay. <laughs> Part four, the end of everything? Achievement unlocked, the end. Holy shit. Holy shit. Uh, okay, so they're just playing video games. Nice. Nice. Yep. I barely remember how to play this. Well, obviously you're not playing since you're not holding a controller. It's like riding a bike. I play this game in my head when I'm falling asleep. Hmm. I like go over the plots of books I've read. Oh, look at the smarty. I try to remember every place I've never been. I've ever been. In order. Wow. Um. Alright, well. Um. Are we? No way. We're controlling Bay. So, no word from her parents? Nope. Did you leave a message? That's bad, right? Yep. Yep. Thanks, guys. This game had a great soundtrack. Very high school summer. I listened to like half the bands on it. We're going to see if the blank stones... The, the, to see the blank stones in a few days. Or we were. I don't know. Sorry, my, I, my heart's still racing from before. So, from what I've gathered... They got seen, they saw May, and she ran like hell. And, oh god, I am worried about May. I played this until I broke one of the sticks. That's harsh. I don't screw around. That's the spirit. Okay, uh, is Angus in here? I'm so tired. I could, like, curl up on their bed. There's, like, a whole living area under there. I don't see anyone out there. Just wait. He'll be back. So we still have no idea who this is. And the cops? We called. They don't care. That's it? Sir, you say you saw a man outside. Sir, that's not illegal. Getting dark earlier. Okay, so got brownies. Okay, so they're basically... They're basically camping out. In the apartment. And they don't know what the hell happened to May. Want some brownies? I'm making brownies. And, yeah. Maybe lasagna. Lasagna? Brownies? I found one in the freezer. Why all the food? Need to eat. Everyone needs to eat. Aren't you, like, scared and worried? Good dinner makes everyone feel better. <clears throat> Ooh, pardon me. Someone's gotta take care of you. Thanks, Angus. You're extremely good. Aw, uh, no more than anyone else. So that guy in the woods... So that guy you saw in the woods at Possum Jump. Yep. Were those guys like that guy? Yep, sorta. He had a hat. Hmm. I need to defrost the lasagna. Or do I? Do you cook it frozen? I believe you actually defrost it first. So, we're stuck here... And we get to control Bay, which is different. Guys, this is a bad situation. Yep. Yep. Yes, I'm... Wait, everybody shut up. I hear cop cars. What? I heard it too. Seriously, what? There's someone standing outside the door. What? Everyone be very quiet. Oh my god. Uh. What? Everything went dark. Okay. Where are we? Holy shit, it's May. Oh shit. May fell. May fell and she's injured right now. 
Holy shit, she looks hurt. Okay, so... We got separated from our friends, and May wound up running. Wait a minute. Those poles. That looks like... This is the food donkey. Or at least where it was? Where even are we right now? <coughs> Well, it's broad daylight ish. <coughs> <coughs> okay. So while we're walking, injured, to recap, we discovered what looks like a cult in the woods. One of them got their uh, leg trapped. They saw us, gave chase, May got separated from her friends, and now she's out. Injured. Oh gosh, what is happening? Is that the church? Holy shit it is. God is here. Really gotta start with that. Wait, who's that guy on the right? I don't think I've ever seen him before. Or at least he... I haven't, I haven't seen much of him. In this room, I believe that. Times like this, we can call out and know that our cries are heard. <laughs> While we are here, maybe someone would like to say something about me. Wait. Is me. No, 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 no. Maybe May can't be dead or anything, right? Maybe someone would like to say something about May? That'd be nice. May is a good girl. She and I explored the stars. And... And she loved to hear about them. She... May can't be dead. That can be difficult. Anyone else? <clears throat> I'll say something. May Borowski's always been a menace. And I called the police on her more than once. I hope she wakes up and learns her lesson. That's all I got to say. Uh, okay. Thank you, William. I'll speak up. Go ahead. May was a daughter to all of us on the block. Speak for yourself. Sometimes, folks, is in the wrong place at the wrong time. I hope we find out what exactly happened to her. Oh, we know. Her friends told us. Yeah, they were out in the woods at night. Down the... Down the end of Caver Ca Century Ave? How do you even say that word? And someone was out there hunting illegally. And they shot at. And they shot at. And May fell and. She must have fallen off a million things a million times. All it takes is landing the wrong way and one time and. Oh. So that was a gunshot! Well. I hope she wakes up soon and tells us all about it. See if she remembers who'd done it. I'm sure she. Okay, so she's basically in the hospital now. Or at least that's what it looks like. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt. What's happened to this one? Do we know you? Are you here to clean up? Nah, supposed to be fixing a door. In here? Nope. Okay, so... She's gonna be fine. For today, le least a ways. What? What? Who are you? Janitor. The house is gone. Holy shit, she's awake. What did you say, May? It's dead. What's dead, honey? May? Honey? Everything. Is she dreaming right now? And talking in her sleep or something? Oh, please don't let it beep. Don't. Please keep beeping. Ugh. Ugh. 
So... Are we dreaming right now? I feel like we have to go this way. Oh my god. May? Oh my god, May? Holy shit, it's May. It's me. He came back to life. I don't think she was dead. Pizza party! I'm feeling woozy. You should lay down. You can sleep in our bed. I feel weird about that. About the couch. Do I have to stop playing? No. The sound is good. Okay! So, I'm guessing May just fell. She didn't get shot. Her mom said it's okay to keep her here. I'll drive her home later. So, she just, like, wandered out of her house? Yeah, and all the way up here. All the way here. <coughs> Jeez. Lucky she didn't pass out somewhere out there. So, whose point of view are we seeing this all from? May's? Because then this would mean she's, like, falling in and out of consciousness. I sure hope she's alright. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't... The only thing those two can... Re Both of you. Shh. Yeah, the only thing they can really do is just wait. So how well do you know this guy? We order pizza that... What, twice a week? At least. From, our, from out by the highway now, since possibilities closed down. I thought you two were trying to save money. What? Don't police our lifestyle, bae. Okay, well, just as long as we're sure this delivery guy is safe. Yeah. Bay is not taking any chances. I can spot him through the keyhole. If it's not him, well, we'll turn off the lights. And I guess hide here until we die. Pardon me. Alright, well, as long as there's a plan. Oi. I am sorry, I'm gassy this episode. Hello? Look who's awake. It's him. It's the pizza guy. Pizza's here. Is it really the pizza guy? Ooh. So what happened? I guess May's sick. We called the cops. Your aunt and some guy fished you out of the woods. You were like in a coma. Did you die? Nah, it just took a very long nap. Nice. Uh, yeah, nice. I had this dream, or like a vision, or I time traveled. I don't know, I'm like in and out of consciousness. Can you not eat? You should eat. I don't know if I can. Sorry, Mom. You scared us to death, honey. Sorry, Mom. We'll come pick you up. No, it's cool. I'm gonna just sleep here. Bay is there? Bay is here. Okay. I'll be back in the morning. Have Bay drive you home. I will. May? I know. Give us a call if you need, a co need to come home. I will. Love you, Mom. Love you, sweetie. Okay, so shit has really gotten real here. You want a brownie? Nah, I can't really eat right now. Like, I'd puke, but there isn't anything in there. So I'd, like, puke my actual guts out. Or just dry heave. Alright. You need your guts. For the moment, at least. At least she's got her sense of humor. And it's night right now, I just noticed by looking at the window. <coughs> Dude, wild week, huh? You could say that. When we get out of this, I don't know if we're getting out of this. Well, even if we don't, and we're ghosts, we should hang out more. Deal. 
Let's talk to Germ. What even was that game? Werewolf. Shred the ge Shred the Gnar 3. Wow. I played this at Casey's house, like, years ago. I played it yesterday at home. Cool. I'm guessing Bay is in the other room. Yep, called it. They've got Wi-Fi! Nice. It's like we're a real place. At least within range. I don't even have a phone because of this place. It's the 1800s here. Hey, May. Yeah? I'm really glad you're not dead. Me too. Yeah. 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 Can we all, like, hit the sack? Cool. I'll be right out. Okay, so I guess cutscene time. <coughs> I'm not controlling anything. Hey kids, can we do lights out now? I'm gonna drop over. Yeah, dude. Sounds good. See you all tomorrow. You sure it's safe for you to leave? None of this got anything to do with me. No weirdos are following me around. Yeah, he's he's neutral. Hopefully. Germ is neutral. See ya. Bye, Germ. Do you know why I beat down Andy Cullen six years ago? No. We weren't talking then, and I thought it'd be weird to bring it up now, and... I was playing this video game. You were, like, dating ghosts or something. Okay. And I was really into it. Played it, like, 24-7. Until this one afternoon. And suddenly, like, something broke. Broke? It was just, like, pixels. The characters on screen... I felt like I knew them. They weren't people anymore, they were just shapes. And their lines were just things someone had written. And they never existed, they never had feelings. They never would exist either. And it feels so sad. Like I just look... Like I just lost these real people. And this whole thing we made, it was just me, alone. And like that realization, like, dumped out of the screen and into real life. Went outside and the tree out front. I looked at it every day. It was like a friend outside the window. Now it was just a thing. Just a thing that was there. Growing and eating and just being there. Like all the stuff I felt about the tree was just in my head. And there was some guy walking by and he was just shapes. Just, like, s this moving bulk of stuff. And I cried. Because nothing was there for me anymore. It was all just stuff. Stuff in the universe. Just dead. Wow, that's... Huh. And the next day was the softball game. And Annie was the pitcher when I was up. And he was just shapes too. Just lines someone wrote. Like, nothing in there. And when I... And I was so scared... And angry that I just... I don't know. Before I knew it, I was on top of him, smashing his face in with the bat. Just shapes. Red shapes all over the grass. Oh my god, May. Have you talked to anyone about this? After it happened, they made me go to therapy. With Dr. Hank. Oh god, he's the worst. And he made me start a journal. A journal? Yeah, he kind of just said it would help to be able to get my thoughts down. Did it help? Kinda? Sorta? But since this whole thing happened, and I'm alone in a few places, it's all shapes. Like back at the softball game. I was doing fine at college for a while, but I couldn't make friends. I was just afraid of being outside or around people alone. And there was a statue of, like, the founder or something. A really shitty statue, like all rusty metal. And it was these shapes. And he was pointing down at me. And I was so scared. I didn't leave my dorm room. Either didn't I either didn't eat or I ate entire pieces at once. I downed cough syrup just to sleep all the time. And finally I got up the courage to leave. And I came home where everything was fine. 
where I knew everyone, and it wasn't just dead shapes watching me. Jeez. Something broke in my head. In my life. I don't mean to be like, whatever, but it sounds like you're suffering from some serious stuff. And like, I can help you find some help for it. Dr. Hank already tried. I think Dr. Hank should stick to family medicine and dentistry. And the half dozen other things he does. And maybe leave the mental health services to someone else. Like, there are things... Like, there are such things as depression and anxiety and like... I don't know. What you're going through. It exists. I... I thought when I came home, I just... I felt so safe here. And everything made sense for a few days. And then all this... And... 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 Shh. It's gonna be okay. We'll figure this out. I'm so scared. I know. We're all scared. But we're gonna make it. You should get some sleep. I... And... Faye's asleep with a lit cigarette in her mouth! Dumb move, Bay. Bye, guys. Wait. She's leaving? Love you. Where's- where's May going? The hole in the center of everything. Okay, we're apparently back in the woods. <coughs> <coughs> okay, we're apparently going to this hole for some reason. It's him again. What are you? Are you actually a ghost? Or just some guy? That's a miner's hat. What is this thing in my head? Are you doing this? Why is this happening to me? Talk! Fine. Let's do this. Holy shit! Boom. Greg is fucking awesome! Get away from her, you piece of shit! You're outnumbered, asshole. Ah, you shot me! And we call all use of- and we can use both of our arms. We- and we can all use both of our arms. That's his arm! The arm we- that's his fucking arm! <laughs>
What do we do? Follow him, I guess. You all wait here. No, I have to go alone. Anyway. Yeah, anyway. If he's up in the mine, we might be able to corner him and... Tie him up? Or something. Can you walk me? I... I think so. Might be a little slow. I'll help you if you need to need it. Thanks, big guy. Alright, let's go do something really stupid. Gate's open. Oh, jeez. What? We could, like, block it shut or something. Oh, oh, dang, you're right. No. He, it, whatever. I have to go down there. Well then, looks like all of his friends are gone. Just one guy. Just one guy. Just one something. Bang bang. Does he have more arrows? Well, this isn't dangerous or anything. Haha. <laughs> Nothing to be scared of down here, just a party. <laughs> Not too late to throw ourselves into traffic instead. Seriously, what the hell's going on down here? Okay, a lever. Will that do something? Okay, I stopped for a second there because I got like a frame drop. Is someone crying? Looks like he took the elevator down. So much for the element of surprise. He's gonna hear us coming a mile away. We sure... We sure we want to do this? Yeah, May, you sure? Guys, I don't know if you understand. <coughs> He's in my head. I can't function like this. Everything is dying or dead already. I... I don't know what's gonna happen down there. Okay, then. We'll come out of this together. Oh, Angus got the switch. <coughs> Oof. That thing looks old. They haven't used this mine in, like, a lot of years. Generations, even. Are you our tour guide now? We have Possum Springs Tourism- We have Possum Springs Tourism pamphlets at the shop. And I get bored. This is in the brochure. <coughs> well, here we are. <coughs> May, you okay? I have my inhaler. No, I'm fine. It's just like- It's like something huge is on top of me. I mean, technically you're not wrong. Is it like asthma? That's how asthma is. It's not asthma, big guy. But thanks. Shh. I hear something. Down there. You going to be okay, May? Yeah, I'm alright. We should be quiet. Yeah, gotta save up for the screaming later. <laughs> I swear, I hear someone crying. Whoa, this is trippy. We can see stars now. This is like one of her dreams. What do you... Door. Door. Tunnel. Whatever. Here we go. I am, like, really anxious right now. What could possibly happen? Well, there's benches. Torn feet, pieces of fabric. Aw, oh, jeez. What is this place? Looks like a church or something. <clears throat> Oi, pardon me. And like, junk. Oh god. Oh god. What is it? It's here. It's here. Oh god. What is it? I don't know, but it's here. It's through there. 
So May has like a sixth sense. Or whatever the hell is going on here. <coughs> Into the abyss. The only thing we'll be able to see is Bay's lit cigarette. I know you're in here. Say something. Well, how about this? Take a couple more steps forward if you want to die. Show yourself. Yeah, asshole, we're like five times scarier than you. Um. Oh. He was legit warning us. There they are. They're right there. I'm going to kill them. Eat. You'll do no such thing. It's out of your hands now. He shot me. Then I'd say we're even. Little girl got shot at the other night. Yeah, sorry about that. You're apologizing? It was a bad call. I am sorry. Uh, it's okay. I didn't actually hit me, so... Wait, what the... Who are you? Bunch of old boys doing their damnedest to protect their own and their, and their neighbors. The, then why are you trying to kill me? Kill you? Nobody's gonna kill you. All of you are part of this town. By family, re relation, or just by being hard workers. Contributors. Um, okay. So we could just leave? Well, he brought you down here for a reason. And he's not going to let you leave until he's had his say. Well, he's already got an arrow through the shoulder. I don't think he's going to be le having much say in whatever. Wait, so you think that... He'd... He kidnapped that kid at Harvest. He's been in my head somehow. I'm always tired, constant headaches. He's been following me, following all of us. He... Oh, little girl. You don't know what this is, do you? What? Oh, God. I've seen this. Or I've... I felt it. Was Ed Scooter and Jim Dornar who found it? 20 years back or so. After the West Mine closed out past Brittle. Vast... Sh I can't pronounce that word. Last supervisor was out there when the company locked off the entrance, carved his initials and date in this in the door. Then you got this mine, the old one, not even a proper mine, big hole, copper, abandoned, shoot, long before any of us were born, too close to water, and that water was poison. When the first settlers came out here, that old spring used to be right above where we're standing. But that water dried up. 1992, or so some men from West Mine, come back up here to try bootlegging. Practically built a new elevator, got the main tunnel cleared, never found no coal, just dug deeper and deeper, till Ed busts through that wall and finds this place and Jim walks right into that hole and never hits bottom Ed calls down to Jim Jim doesn't answer but someone else does I know you heard that voice girl in dreams and in wa waking times it's what brought you down here what what is it so what does this have to do with you or me or anyone you got to understand, in those days, it was the end of the world. Jobs gone, our kids were leaving, government didn't care, only wanted our votes. Just put it in more regulations, send in our jobs overseas. Spend in our taxes on lazy people and immigrants. While we worked ourselves to death. Uh, here we go. God damn, I hate this crap. You old dipshits. You finished? Yeah, sure. We prayed and prayed up at the church, 
But when Ed Scudder came back down here and listened, he got answers back. Oh god, I think I know. Yeah, he's already in there singing to you, right? I... I... Ed explained it to a few folks, and they didn't believe it. But he was persuasive. He had the glimmer. The glimmer? Ones he takes a shining to. It rubs off on you. You can do things. I never seen it. But they said Ed could walk through walls. Okay. After Ed talked us into all this. After that first time after we picked one out. Well, not only was the town holding stable, but it was almost like we were getting younger and money came too. Still had a few of us left from back then. Picked? First time. First one into the hole by our own hands. We own up to what we do. I was there. I was too. You throw them into the hole? They're... Feeding him? He's hungry like you wouldn't believe. Every few months or so, he starts singing. And it's something... And it... And it's someone's turn to find someone. Was that what you were doing the other night? No. What happened the other night was a shame. One of our net one of our number broke the rules and had to pay up. That was a hard thing to do. I think I'm going to be sick. We never pick no one who's going to be missed. That's a solid rule. Drifters, drunks, and delinquents. You've been oh god. Oh no. Casey? The Hartley kid? All he was gonna contribute to society, except a bunch of kids growing up with no dad, was a rat sh rap sheet a mile long before whatever said, whatever sad end he'd wind up at. We did him a favor. So they killed Casey! You killed Casey? Oh my god. We don't use that word. You know he was taking up business with his cousin, right? You know what happened to his cousin? Burned alive when his little trailer lab exploded. They had to wear hazmat suits when they cleaned him up. That's where Casey was headed. You killed Casey. And you want to act like he didn't... Like we didn't do him this whole... Sorry. And you want to act like we didn't do him and this whole town a favor. Oh god, Casey's been down there this whole time. His parents put up posters. Maybe they should have cared more about him before he came to this. Which one of you did it? Greg. He was my friend. Right now, throw down. Right now, or I will shoot. <laughs> what if I get you first? Bolts sticking right out of your eye. Bang. Bang! You brought guns down here? Dangerous this far out in the woods at night. Basic safety. I... I... Throw it down, son. Don't make this uh, our time. Greg. Dang it. You're monsters. None of this... None of this is happening. We are not monsters. We do it because we love our home. As long as we keep doing this, Possum Springs survives. Things can get better. These mines are gonna be humming again someday. Old Miles puff and smoke. You kids don't understand that. We lost what our world was built around. Used to be you provided for fit. Used to be you provided for a family. Brought a bought a house. Now you're stocking shelves at the grocery store. Kids leaving more than they're staying. No opportunity here. Old people dying. Houses left empty. You ever seen that? A home become a tr a tumbled in pile of wood and plaster. A job become a burned out brick box or a hole in the ground. 
but we can change that. We can put this place back together where it won't be just shapes. I'm going to die down here. Why are you telling us all this? Because we're getting old. And even with the fringe benefit of good health, we need new blood to carry this on when we're gone. Really? You're like pitching us on this? Were any of you even miners back in the day? Any of you hurting now, financially? Like, or is this just some big costume party murder club? For someone's shitty boss who's afraid of dying? That don't matter. <clears throat> it does. This is real bad. This is insane. Why shouldn't we just call the cops and say, what? You saw some men you can't identify in an abandoned mine behind a locked gate? And an elevator that won't run? That you saw a hole? Okay, fine. Why should we help you? Because if no one is here to do this, you remember that flood a few years back? You remember the blizzard of 2010? That's what happens. And beyond that, the jobs never come back. The kids never come back. Everything crumbles. Possum Spring bleeds to death. And soon we'll all be dead. And this town will just be fields and trees. I've seen it. I know you have. I'll understand if you need some time to think it over. So we can leave? No one's gonna stop you. But understand that you don't know who we are. Out there. But we know who you all are. Ain't fair they get to leave and I probably got permanent damage. Shut it, Aid. You don't know a thing about what he wants. What he is. Eid, I swear to God. Let's go. Yeah, let's seriously get out of here. Son, you leave that crossbow. What? Why? Well, I could bullshit you. But the truth is, I just don't trust you. Fine, whatever. It's a piece of shit anyways. <laughs> I... I can't move you guys. I'll carry you. I have no idea what to even think about any of this. It's just... horror. That's not a word you get to use too often. That's all I've got left. Like everything else in my head is gone. Let's get out of here fast. I don't know if I... Shh. Talk later. Old, old stuff in here. Okay, I'm gonna have to put you down for a sec, okay? Okay. So, Casey. Yeah. I... Yeah. And for what? I... I think I get it. Wow, really? Too tired to explain it right, but... Like... They lost what they thought was gonna happen. Which was what had happened, like, a long time ago. Or how they remember, or, like, picture it. And things it gave them. And so Casey and that kid at Harvest, and... Sorry, I lost it. That's more sense than I can make of it. They're sad. It's all really sad. You ready to go again, Angus? Yep. Sorry. Wait, everybody shut up. What? Shh, I thought I... Oh shit! Oh shit!
I think I recognize the silhouette. Holy shit. Is everyone okay? May. May, are you okay? May, say something. <laughs> May? <laughs> oh, she's crying now. It's okay. I've got you. He's gone now. Shit. How are we gonna get out of here? Shh. Give her a minute. I feel air coming in from somewhere. So we're not gonna suffocate. Okay, well that's a relief. How did you... How do you... I was a scout, Greg. I was a scout. Hey, Angus. Yeah? I love you. Aww. Welcome back, May. You okay? Better now that I almost got murdered. Again. Which is weird. <coughs> that was like the third time in two days. Third time's the charm. Guys, the air is coming from back here. Alright, I'm up. You sure? Yeah, I think I can walk at least. It's boarded up. Long time ago. Can we get through? Let's find out. Let's get out of here. Oh jeez. Yep, that's some fresh air alright. <laughs> and water. Dude, that's amazing. You can smell water? Hopefully it's not a river. Cave rivers are death traps. Mine river. We're in a mine. Right. Okay, I can't access the book. Hmm. I can see the bottom. I don't think we're gonna die in the one foot of water. Right. Oh shit! I know what you are now. I think I knew it before, but... You know, after I sent that kid to the hospital, years ago, they said I had an anger problem. But that's not true. I was angry because of something else. Something I'd lost. Trying so hard since... Not to be angry. Got me all defenseless. And I lost more, and more, and more. That's not getting better. I want to be angry. When I ran home from college, on the bus I had this dream. Or maybe I saw it out the window. Last leaf on, it, on the tree. Finally blown off. I'm so scared. All the time. And the fear hurts. Feeling like everything is over. Was over long before I got here. So long hiding. Or trying to outrun this. I get it. This won't stop until I die. But when I die, I want it to hurt. When my friends leave, when I have to go, let go, when this entire town is wiped off the map, I want it to hurt. Bad. I want to lose. I want to get beaten up. I want to hold on until I'm thrown off and everything ends. And you know what? Until that happens, I want to hope again. I want it to hurt. Because that means it meant something. It means I'm something, at least. <laughs> Pretty amazing to some be something, at least. Whoa! What does that mean? You know I can't understand you, right? Oh, shut up already. I know this won't save me in the end. But I don't need it to save me forever. I just need it to save me now. So if you're gonna kill me right here, then do it. If not... May? Dude, you okay? Whoa. 
You got all sleepwalky there for a sec. You want me to carry you? No. I think I'm good. I'm just... Very, very tired. Hang here for a bit if you need to. We're safe. Uh-huh. Hey, there's light over there. Do you smell that? I bet he did. May looks better. Let me actually look back a bit. Can I examine anything? Nope, doesn't look like it. Okay, let's move on. This is going to be the longest episode ever. <coughs> what the? What is this? Might be a vent or something. Keep the miners from suffocating way back when. It looks old enough at least. Brochure. Hello? We're down here. Don't ask us why, please. Could get lucky and someone's out here in the woods at night. I... I can try to make it out. No. I can, like... Okay, yeah. Are you up for this? Yeah. I don't know. I'm, like, all hyper now. Like, dolphins. Hyper like dolphins? No, like when your body is like, uh, whoa, I almost died. And you get all hyper because you're filled with a, with dolphins. You mean adrenaline? Okay, I am seriously confused. Are you okay, May? Endorphins. Ah, okay. There. Thank you. Those. Okay, well. Ride those dolphins up out of here. Ugh, that's assuming I could even do this. We'll watch. Okay. Fifty bucks says it's gonna be that box we saw in the dream before. Called it! This place. Huh. Hey, May. Germ? Yeah. What are you doing out here? I live right up the hill. I heard Greg yelling. We were all stuck down there. You, you were at the bottom of the old well in my backyard? It's been a really bad night. Sounds like it. Got any rope or something? Yeah. Can you go get it? Hey, May. Yeah? Was that germ? Yeah, he's getting some rope. What is he doing out here? He lives here. In the woods? Yep. Angus has his asthma problem again. My entire body hurts. That was a long way. I brought some sodas. You're the best, germ. You need the sugar and caffeine. Oh, uh, anyone else want to get far away from this well? Yup. Germ, can you, like, I don't know, seal up this well? Hmm. I got dynamite. What? Yeah, I mean, I can get some. How big an explosion is that? I mean, not small. Okay, that works. <coughs> thanks, Germ. Yeah, thanks, buddy. Um, okay. Bye, guys. There goes a weird, weird guy. He saved our lives. Germ is good. Germ is a good man. It strikes me that we just murdered all those dudes down there. How do you figure? Well, I mean, the elevator's broken and we caused a cave-in. That was self-defense. I guess, but we did cause the death deaths of, like, a dozen guys. No, no, no. They're all still alive down there. 
How are you so sure? Oh god. Yeah. Jeez. Well, we're blameless. They attacked us. One of them attacked us. So we're worrying about, like, it's, moral it's morally gray. We're not murderers. Like, if we had a choice, we wouldn't have done it. I would have. Uh, what? They, like, killed people. They were trying to get us to kill people. Screw them! I don't even believe in hell, and I hope they all go straight there. Jeez, Angus. Well, that's what I think, at least. Hmm. This is like that trolley thing. What trolley thing? Okay, I'll explain it if we keep walking. I'm waiting for an explosion to happen because of germ. Hey, guys. Uh, are you there? Anyone? They're probably out cold. Okay, I'm gonna type anyway. Hard for me to say anything smart about what the hell even just happened. Easier for me to get it all out here. And I need to talk. Even if you jerks are off doing whatever. None of us asked for any of this. And it didn't happen to us because we're, like, special. You can work as hard as you want, but... The universe is gonna keep doing what it does. And I don't think any of us deserved all this. This is all stuff that started long before we were born. It's all like moving so fast and you're dropped into it. And you're just trying to grab onto something. All of you are what kept me from floating off tonight. You also kind of killed that guy to save me. Don't think I did uh, didn't appreciate don't think I didn't appreciate that. LOL. LOL. Don't know if I'm ever going to understand what all just happened. I hope it stopped. I just feel right now like all I want to do is wrap my arms around all of you. Not just because I love you, but to keep you all together with me. Wrap up into a ball and no one can hurt us. Sorry, I'm rambling. Germ buddy. Germ, you don't even use messenger. I guess I'm just typing at you wherever you are at. Bay, you're definitely something. I'm so sorry about all you've gone through. I don't even understand all of your problems. But if I could fix but if I could, I'd fix them. I'd fix all of it. And I'd buy the tools to do it from your store. Or like borrow them at least. A better friend would buy, but what I but what I'm but I'm what you got. And I'm glad. Yep, there it is. Now, I'm just gonna erase all that. Oh shit. <laughs> Guys, I was just kidding about a lot of that. I'm really tired. I don't know what I'm saying. Log off, May. Log off. <laughs>